Should you stay away from cashback mortgage offers? Consider the following when wanting to stay away from cashback. Do you want to take advantage of this hot greater Toronto real estate market? Are you better renting versus buying and not sure regarding market conditions? Can you ponder on this, my mortgage amount is a kind of forced saving? Are you bogged down with interest rates and not wanting to dwell further? How to purchase a house with cash back mortgage plus get money for renovations. This one is interesting if you foresee minor renovations or are indulging in a fixer upper. Some lending institutions offer cash back mortgages and affiliate themselves with a program called Purchase Plus Improvement. So let's say you qualify for a mortgage up to $500,000. But you are only buying a property whose purchase price is $450,000. Under this program you may qualify and can get money for renovations. So how can I buy a house with zero down payment? For initial down payment, you can use your RRSP. Under the home buyer's plan you can take out up to $25,000 per person from your RRSP. Some lending institutions will allow you to take out money from your line of credit. Repay line of credit with cash but thereby prompting buy with zero down payment. How can I stop renting and buy with zero down payment? Yes you can stop renting and indulge in buying your first property. First check your credit score. If you have a good credit score you can qualify for a cash back mortgage. Call or email me to walk you through. Should you stay away from mortgage cash back offers? Yes, if you cannot afford the per month mortgage amount as it is higher. Yes, if want to qualify for a higher mortgage amount. Yes, if you have your own down payment. What is a cash back mortgage? Some lenders including banks offer a cash back mortgage program. Meaning a certain portion of the property value is rebated to the purchaser upon successful closing. Now you will ask what's the catch with cash back mortgage? They charge a higher interest rate. They don't offer a variable interest rate. If you break the mortgage term you have to return the cash back. Additionally, you have to qualify for an amount with posted interest rate. How to get approved for a cash back mortgage. I have assisted many of my clients with cash back mortgages plus money for renovations to fulfill their dreams of owning a home. Feel free to call or email me regarding your unique situation. You will feel glad you called and thank yourself later. Is cash back mortgage good or bad? With hot Toronto real estate market where you will only pay $5,000 extra. For a $500,000 mortgage and in the same time the value of a property in 5 years could easily increase substantially it's a no-brainer that it can be a great deal. How to buy a house with no money down as a first time home buyer. Here are a few options for a first time home buyer. Borrow initial down payment funds from family, friends etc as gift. First time buyers can use their RRSP for the down payment. Some lenders will allow using your line of credit for initial deposit. Repay funds with cash back there by prompting buy with zero down payment. How much money is required for down payment and closing costs? Generally you require 5% of purchase price as initial down payment. Closing costs are generally 1.5% of the purchase price. Regarding closing costs, this amount you have to come up by yourself. Consider first and last month rent, additional savings, borrow from family, friends etc. Sometimes you may qualify for an extra cash back to augment this amount. You also get a refund being a first time buyer. If you do all the math, it is not difficult to come up with this amount.